Hi, Dave here, Mega Points Controllers. A little overdue this video, so I thought I'd, uh, I'd better show you uh, a product that's just gone on the website. This is the remote setup uh, adapter for the servo controller. And we've moved the four buttons here with a two meter cable so that you can um, easily set up your servo controller without having to crawl underneath your baseboard. It doesn't replicate the LEDs, um, but it does replicate the switches. So it's here in a nice, easy to use package. Um, I'll show you how it works now. So here's one of my demonstration servo controllers. And normally I'd use these buttons to set up the um, movement ranges and personalities of each of the channels. This time I'll hook up the uh, remote setup switch. The cable has one side marked with a, a reddish tinge. So as long as you match that with the pin or the ground on the remote board and the ground on the servo controller, everything will work. So I'll drop this into the pin here and I'll take the other end and I'll drop this onto the servo controller. So what I'll do to, uh, to demonstrate this is I will use channel one here with the semaphore on it. At this point you can see it's moving smoothly like it would for a point motor. So I have these four buttons here replicated into this little handheld unit now at the end of a two meter cable. So I'll press prog once, servo jumps to the midpoint. I'll set the mode to mode three and now I'll adjust the endpoints. So first of all, I'll set to where I want clear and I'll press the high button to set danger about there. I'll scoot through the other 11 channels because I don't want to change them. And now when I operate the switch, you'll see it's taken on the personality of a upper quadrant semaphore signal with a little bit of bounce. And if I want to reverse that, I'll select the uh, program mode. I'll select the mode number four, which will give me the opposite bounce. And now what you'll see is when I operate, it drops down and then you get the bounce at the top, just like you would on a lower quadrant semaphore. You'll find this in the shop now. Thank you very much for watching.